Hello, barbecue friends. It's great to have you here on our Churrasqueadas channel. Have you ever eaten portney? It's well known as Einsbein. Back in Germany, it's a very popular dish. But today we are going to prepare pork knee here on the barbecue grill. Pork knee. We have the front one and the one in the back. The back part has more meat, okay? When you go there and ask your butcher, ask for the back part, okay? It's very tasty, as I said, known as Eisbein back in Germany. And we are going to prepare with dry rub, right? <laughs> dry seasoning. You will get enough salt for this piece. Some red pepper. This thing here, I don't even know what that is, but this one, it's garlic powder. Pork meat loves garlic, garlic and salt, and you don't need anything else. You will get some paprika, a nice amount. This is lemon pepper. It's very aromatic, flavorful, very tasty. And this one is thyme. Thyme is really good, but don't exaggerate on it. Once I was grilling a steak, <laughs> and I threw around two kilos of thyme in a one kilo steak. Imagine what happened, right? Before proceeding with the pork knee recipe, first you have to subscribe here on our channel, okay? <laughs> Sign up and click on the bell. You will receive a notification every time we have a new recipe. Twice a week, isn't it great? That stops. Then you will get the pork knee, get some dry rub, and spread it carefully all along the entire length of the piece. Look at that. Look how tasty it looks. The way Eisbein is prepared in Germany varies a lot from place to place. There are regimes there where they make the Eisbein served with mashed green peas. Do you have a mashed pea recipe there? Send it to us. Next time we prepare it here together. It's beautiful. Check that baby out. But our pork knee here, it's prepared the barbecue style. Germans don't even know. I was going to say that Germans don't even know what barbecue is, but they know. Sorry about that. You guys are great. Okay then, they are bad at soccer, right? Remember the Brazil World Cup? The World Cup in Brazil? I don't remember. Do you remember? All seasoned. It smells really good. Where should it go? to the grill then we are going to place it here in this type of barbecue grill stop right there right there baby standing like this you gotta stand there baby no lying down no like my brother-in-law that lazy guy <laughs> you will place it here medium temperature around 15 inches from the fire standing here on the barbecue grill in a little while we will be turning turning and turning it again that pork knee, I guarantee it will be much better than the sauerkraut from the Germans. It's going to be 7-1 on them. 7-0. And it has a very tasty side dish. We are using cabbage, okay? Let's do this. This is something from the Germans who make the sauerkraut there. But their sauerkraut is very curious, you know? They remove the leaves adds a lot of salt, put something on top of it and leave it there dehydrating. Then they season it to taste and wait four to six months to eat it, to eat with the pork knee, with sauerkraut. Are we going to wait this long? Of course not. We are going to get the cabbage, cut it very thin, look, barbecue style. You get a very sharp knife like this one, okay, look and cut it very thin, which is much more pleasant. There's no hard work, no separating leaves here, no way. I need you to comment there. What do you think about our recipe, okay? I want to know your opinion, please. It's very important for us. After chopping the cabbage, it could be either the red cabbage or the green one, okay? No problem. It's white. So it's white. There, look, white. This is not white for me. This is green. My staff said so. It's white, okay? 
So we have the purple cabbage and there is the white one which for me is green. Let's use here just a purple one, okay? We are not going to have a problem because of that, right? You will get some leek, cut it very thin as well, look, and let's go, barbecuing everything together, all together and mixed up here, look. Then you will get some parsley. What is parsley? Some people asked me the other day, parsley, parsley and chive together. Finish chopping, then we will put everything together here. Then you will season to taste. Black pepper, okay. Don't you want to use black pepper? No problem. So don't use it, okay? That's fine. So you don't want black pepper? So we are going to use cayenne pepper. Take the seed out of it here to ease the burning a little. Cayenne pepper chopped, very tiny. How beautiful, I love it. Then you will get some salt without exaggerating, okay? Some olive oil also, all mixed and stirred. We didn't have to wait five to six months to get it ready, but it's a great side dish for our pork knee. Let's turn the knee over because we have to keep the boy down. While our pork knee is roasting there, you get a big glass like this one and let's make a toast to our brother-in-law. Cheers. That stops. Our pork knee stayed there for three hours, okay? We were turning it around, do you remember? It's turning for three hours. Now let's check if it's really, really good. Smells great, smells great in here, guys. Look at that very crunchy. Wow, the smell here is great. Very, very crispy. Check out the crunchiness. Can you hear it? And it's not alone. Let's see, very crunchy, whoa. And it's not going to be served alone. It will be followed with that wonderful salad we have prepared before. That's great. Let's get some pork knee meat here. Remove this part here so the brother-in-law can eat in the meantime. Check out how beautiful this dish is, guys. Check out the smoke coming out. Hmm? Mmm. 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 Good. Very good. Guys, this salad here with our pork knee was amazing. Prepare it in your house. It's an amazing combination. Not to mention that this side dish is very good for any type of barbecue. Three, two, one. Are you ready, Ju? Can we start? Have you woken up already? You delayed us here today, Ju. Have you ever eaten pork knee? Have you? No? This dish, it's not that. This one, I had asked the staff for curry, but they brought me paprika, so we use paprika. Okay, look. Nice seasoning. The pre pre. It's going to pour, Ju. Ju, come on, it's going to pour, Ju. Sauerkraut. Where's Ju's boom? This isn't sauerkraut, Zamiro, with salad.